This is all brought to you by Ed Prather. Ed Prather Real Estate, the number one trusted team in real estate in Colorado. The best sales team. The Fed, are they going to drop the rates in June? I don't know. Who knows? We'll see. There's lots of talk about it. But this is where you should reach out to Ed and his team and just figure out, is this the right time like it was for me to buy and sell a home? It was for me. And thank God I had Ed Prather. All right, let's go through it. Boom, 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 boom. Nice to have Broncos ownership with deep, deep, deep pockets. Uh, yes, you want that. Uh, non-egotistical, deep pockets, hardworking. You really do want that. I love the abs and nugs, but the regular season is about 15 games too long. I grow weary of it. We'll tune in once the playoffs start. Well, all right, cool. But I'll I'll tell you, and I it, listen. If you're the Celtics and twelve games up in the, I mean, who cares? It's boring. But all these games have significant meaning, feel, and effort. I don't know. I mean, yeah, it's not the playoffs, and the playoffs are at a different level. But it's pretty damn exciting. Seeing a lot of national pundits pushing Jokic aside for MVP again. There is a vibe on that, but don't pay much attention. Just another dominant night for Jokic to pile on others. This is his, of, of his three MVPs, which should be four. This one is as dominant as ever. And the Nuggets are in first place. Yo, D-Mac, these Nugs better win the chip because Wemby and company are coming for years to come. Amen. T.L., I'm telling you. And that, that was a vibe last night. The present and the future. It was fun to watch and easy to see. Love CB, always great effort. Yeah. So what does... Well, I think Reggie will play, but so will CB. And now you can see what the options actually are. KC voters voted down a measure to pay for major improvements to Arrowhead. Too bad Hunt doesn't have the Walton type of money. I feel so sad for the chefs. Sarcasm. I can feel it, Prince. Edward, hope you're recovering from your cold. Try drinking herbal tea and lemon. I am better. I just didn't get a lot of sleep last night, so the voice is kind of paying for it, but I feel great. Rocky's defense was tragic again yesterday. Everything is tragic right now about the Rockies. Rock's on pace for 27 wins. How many wins do you anticipate the Rockies winning this year? It's hard to imagine a team not winning at least 60 games and losing 60 games. And then what do you do with those other 40 games? But even getting to 60 wins may be rough for the Rockies. I guess you could say the Rockies offense was tragic. It was all tragic. RJ, should the Rockies have done more due diligence on Chris Bryant? Batting zero so far. That's pretty rough when you're six games in and you don't have a hit. I always forget Colorado has a pro baseball team. Well, we'll see you Friday for opening day. T-Mac, I texted Tyler at the end of the show to ask him why he still thinks your entire quarterback philosophy is based solely on just take any quarterback as high up as you can in the first round. Thank you, Mark. It's not any quarterback. This year, there's six. Not seven, not eight, not nine or ten. There's six. It's not any quarterback. But if you want to say take any of the six or in one year, any of the four or any of the three or Kenny Pickett's year, any of the one, if, if you want to say there's a group of guys that – fit the bill to be drafted, I I guess that's any of them. But you don't hear me talking about Tuttle or Spencer Rattler, and I might have just made up Tuttle's name. Oh, you got to love him. Don't draft him if you don't love him. Well, the Broncos didn't love Josh Allen. Was that a mistake? Yes, it was. I finally get to see the Nuggets live on Saturday. Good. Have a great time. Come by and say hi. I'm in section 144. Good morning, DMAC. You know, as long as Val is healthy, I'm not too worried 
where the Avs end up in the seeding. Staying the obvious, they're a completely different team without them. No doubt about it. They cannot win in the playoffs without Val. The end. Period. Can't do it. 26. Yes. I once hit zero in Little League. Turns out I needed glasses. And finally, good morning, DMAC. Have a great day. Go Clippers. I got a skedaddle because I'm off to Boulder to um, go see my friends at Trek in Boulder. My guy, Chris, I'm getting a loaner bike. We're working on what bike makes the most sense for me in the future. I still would love to recover my bike, but it's life. You got to move on. So I bid you a fond farewell. Yep. I got to get up to Boulder and then chuckle at pain with Nate and Chad coming to you. Um, at 9 a.m. We'll, we'll get into rich owners and what that means in the NFL. Love you. About last night was fascinating um, for your nuggets, and they're in first place. We'll take it.